Hi everyone, this is Shopke again. Well, it's been a while, more than a week, I guess. I um, have been busy with other things, for example, my digital stuff. I'm playing with my digital kits and products again. And um, But I had made this page um, about a week ago. So I decided to do the voiceover today and upload it to my channel. Here I am uh, going through all the happy mail that I got from Honey, Honey Trump. Uh, on several occasions uh, she sent me some gorgeous stuff and I decided to um, use them for this uh, art journal page. Also I am using a page from the uh, little book, the art journal she made me. And I just took it out, and uh, that's because that's easier uh, to handle. Um, once I've been through all the the, the lovely goodies uh, she sent me, I uh, started with this script paper um, that was in the Happy Mail, and uh, I'm gluing it down with the art medium from Schoening, and here I'm placing a placemat between the pages so it won't stick uh, together. And uh, the next thing I chose is this washi tape. I really love this washi tape. It's um, a black and white dotted pattern. And um, I, I love the neutral colors of old ephemera and papers and writings and envelopes with black and white. and really love that. So that was the first choice. And also using uh, some uh, floral tape that was on there. And it was actually a fabric tape. And it is adhesive, but just to make sure, I'm uh, also using some um, gel medium to make sure it's, it's um, stuck down very well. Then to blend it all in with each other and to um, create um, more of one background than all the, the bits and pieces, I'm adding some gesso just to blend it in. And because that was so crispy white, I'm using um, an acrylic homemade spray, black, to smudge the page a little and make some drops. Now, I'm very sorry that uh, sometimes I'm out of screen with my project. That is because my camera setup is actually a bit too low and I can't zoom out anymore. So I have to be very careful and pay attention that I'm working in screen and sometimes I forget forget so I'm very sorry about that. Uh, I will uh, try and uh, be more careful next time but also I'm um, going to ask my husband <laughs> if he uh, can move it up a bit higher. So using this beautiful napkin of the tulips and a wet brush to draw around the part that I want to use. So it's very easy to tear uh, out of the napkin. And um, I'm going to use that on my page and I'm removing the tissue layers that uh, that's on the back. And to bring back in more of the green color, I'm using a homemade acrylic uh, spray paint again for uh, adding a bit of the green um, on the background. And this lovely stencil was also in the Happy Mail I got from Honey, and that is a Sun. And I'm using a Amsterdam modeling paste to create a few of the, the suns on um, the page. Now, uh, I find this Amsterdam modeling paste a bit thin for my liking, so Maybe I could uh, do a little batch uh, and um, mix it with some baby powder to make it to thicken it up uh, a bit. Uh, that that works, so I'm going to try that for next time. So here I'm gluing down the napkin, the tulip. 
again using the art medium from Schoening still have have a bottle left for um, uh, of that art medium that I really want to use that up so gluing that down and then I pick some more of the a script paper that I have had left and uh, decided that I would glue that down as well and that is just the strip um, that I place just a little off the edge gluing it down with a very inexpensive white glue I got from Action and then um, Going back to the washi tape with the black dots because I like it so much and adding a bit more of that because with adding the gesso I lost a bit of bit of it so um, adding some more and what is the next step I'm using a Faber-Castell uh, pen I believe it's a uh, uh, point two actually very thin fine liner and just scribbling uh, around the edge and these are some gorgeous uh, die cuts I think and I'm searching and see if I can use those I decide not to and taking out my needle t tip uh, bottle with the black acrylic spray to scribble a bit more and do some more splattering as well and then I am searching for the right quote the right words to go along with that uh, I have a few uh, printed out uh, already and saved them in a little uh, box so uh, every now and then I can search for some quotes in there and I picked this one mostly because it was black a black uh, a background with white letters and it says um, in Dutch this is me um, going around the edges with uh, stays on a, um, ink pad and just date and sign the page so this uh, was it for my page using honey Tom's uh, happy mail uh, goodies thanks again honey uh, really loved it all and love to play with it uh, luckily I have some more so I can play some more with those lovely goodies so thank you and um, have a great day see you again very soon bye